Hi everybody, it's me, Jordan, and today I'm talking about when people say you do things that gross me out. Now, for example, there are things that people find inappropriate, and one of the first things that people tend to find is inappropriate is nose picking. Why? Well, I guess there are various reasons. Some people just find it offensive to see somebody putting a finger in their nose. I don't know why, they just do. Okay. But apparently, it's okay if it's a Kleenex, paper towel, napkin, or toilet paper, or whatever. Okay. They claim that you're spreading germs around when you're doing it. Maybe you are. But it's not like you're throwing it at someone. It's not like, you know, you're flicking it on them. But usually goes down something like this. Ew, do you need a Kleenex? Why? Because I know you're picking your nose. And that grossed me out. Well, it's my nose and I'm allowed to pick it, Jordan says. Unless they come up with a new federal, state, county, local law that makes it illegal for people to pick their nose. I don't want to hear from you. I mean, really. Of course, you could lose your privilege to come to the could lose your privilege to come to the place where you were picking your nose if it was a public place and people might not want you in their house if you're picking your nose oh well okay but even though it is gross to a lot of people it's not illegal I mean for example somebody's smoking a cigarette you can't say oh god you're grossing me out you're smoking a cigarette they're like, it's legal, I'm allowed to smoke cigarettes, okay? Like, you can't, let, like, like, it makes, for example, it's like everybody knows that cigarettes are gross, and it's in a very bad habit, but it's like you can't sit there, it's like you can't criticize someone for smoking a cigarette the same way you could criticize them for, I don't know, nose picking it. I don't know, it's like there's a double standard. Um... And also, the double standard tends to come in, it tends to be on bodily functions. Like, you can't control them, but you at least apologize for them. Uh, oh, look. You farted. Yeah, I know, I'm farted. I'm sorry. Ah, God, gross. What crawled up there and died? Nothing crawled up there and died that's not decomposition or smelling. You know, it's like a, there's a double standard for conduct and it tends to be it tends to be that everything gets a double standard sneezing coughing burping and farting and hiccuping are considered gross and it's yet to apologize for them but smoking apparently is frowned down upon but you're not a lot but but people allow it well some people allow it, and some places allow it. We're going to put that in air quotes. Okay? You know? And you know, it's like I, uh, it's like I know smoking growth because you're blowing your smoke around wherever you're at. It's not like, see, you're blowing your smoke and it's going over the place. So somebody could say, Ah, oh, gross. Now i got to get your secondhand smoke because you had to put a cigarette or a cigar in your mouth. Well, that's really... You shouldn't do that. You should have gone outside to do that. You know? But it's like if you're picking your nose, it's like they're going to say, Oh, no, you're going to put the booger on me. You're going to flick the booger on me or someone else. You're going to throw it over the place. I mean, just the fact you're rooting your nose grosses them out. But apparently, cigarettes okay. Apparently, no one gets grossed out by 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 people who smoke and uh, secondhand smoke goes around. No one's concerned about their clothes smelling like smoke or anything else smelling like smoke. There probably are some people. I don't get it. Okay, I get it. Jordan says people don't like your nose and your your finger and your nose, but it's your nose. And it's your finger. Okay, it's not illegal. Alright. Maybe some people might frown down upon you. And they might say things about you. And it might gross them out. Oh, well. 
but it's not illegal. It's not like you could get arrested for or find it for nose picking. And apparently smoking's a legal habit, unfortunately. It's a legal habit. And some places might not condone it. It's not like if you walk into a public place at night they got a circle and it says no nose picking and it shows a person with a, with a finger in their nose with a sensor sign around it. I mean seriously. I mean it's like there are no signs that say you can't do it, but apparently it's one of those unspoken uh, conduct rules about you're not allowed to pick your nose. Okay? It's like you have to put a stupid sign that tells people, oh, I don't want you smoking here. But apparently you don't have to put a sign that tells people, I don't want you picking your nose here. So, okay, you know how it goes, like. So that's it. I'm Jordan, and I'll see you later.